Hi everyone. Well, you know, it's Wednesday and sometimes Wednesday is pretty exciting because it's like you figure, oh my gosh, we are halfway through the week. I've only got two days of work left to do. And then other times it's like, it's Wednesday. I've got two days worth of, I've got two days of work left and I've got at least two weeks worth of work to do to cram into the next two days. And then you get yourself so depressed and worked up that you're just kind of, ah, you're going crazy. So you know what I do on days like that? When I'm done signing off for work, I turn it into Wine Wednesday. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to Wine Wednesday. You know, I'm going to be trying to throw in a few Wellness Wednesdays in between these Wine Wednesdays, but you know, sometimes you just need a Wine Wednesday. You know what I mean? So anyway, today, oh my gosh, I worked until 10 o'clock tonight. I'm exhausted and I said, you know what, I'm going to have a little bit of wine. I had some frozen pizza in the freezer. It's like, put that in the oven. I went and I threw some makeup on, threw a top on and some eye color and some jewelry and a fascinator. And I said, you know what? I'm going to make the most of the day. I'm going to sit and relax with a little bit of wine, a little bit of pizza. Then I'm going to go and watch YouTube for a while and do some watching videos and commenting. Then I'm going to, I don't know if I'm going to read or just take a shower and go to bed after that. I don't know. But anyway, so I haven't, opened any of my sweet wines lately from um, Vino. And so I thought I would open one of my sweet wines tonight. You know, I used to only, only want sweet wines. I wanted nothing to do with the dry or red wines. And now it's like the other way around. And even though I'm having a frozen pizza and I've got two bottles of reds open from other videos that I haven't finished yet. Don't know if I'm going to finish them. I hope I do because I hate wasting them, especially on the ones that I like. I don't mind dumping down ones down the drain anymore that I don't like. But if I like it, I want to keep it. So anyway, I'm going to have one of my Vino wines. And we all know, Vino, hashtag, Nancy wants to PR for Vino someday. And I think the next Vino box, the spring box, is going to be shipping. I don't know if it's the end of April or the end of March, but it's going to be one of those. So looking forward to that. But I'm going to be opening up my Loverly. It is a sweet wine blend. I'm pretty sure I've had this before, but I'm always excited to open it. I love the bottle. I just love those flowers. It just looks so springtime and fresh. And I changed out my pretend flowers in the background. So yeah, I didn't know what to do with that uh, little sugar canister that I got from my last vinyl box. So I decided to just put some seasonal flowers in there. So I just uh, took out my tulips that were fake and uh, put in these little, I think they're daisies and a daffodil. So I thought those were nice and springy. And yes, yeah, so I'll be just kind of changing those out as the season goes. Maybe eventually I will even put some real flowers in there. I really like it when my um, lilacs are in bloom. I've got white and purple lilacs. I just love, love the scent of those. But it's like you bring them in the house and like within a day, all those little petals just fall. So I may look for some pretend lilacs even though I love 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 my my lilacs and the the scent that they have but anyway so the loverly so on the back let's see if we can get the uh, label to show up on camera because I just love some of these sayings so it's a white wine blend 2020 from California and loverly is knowing what brings joy and happiness to your life from a quiet walk in a beautiful garden to the rush and excitement of finding new love. Revel in the peace and euphoria it brings to your soul. Soul, The feeling is what inspired our new wine. So loverly with every sip. And again, such a beautiful, beautiful bottle. And I'm gonna use my little wine opener here. I should have opened this in the meantime, but anyway, I hope you guys are having a fabulous week so far and that your hump day is something special. I think it's time for me to plug this baby back in. Let's charge it up a little bit. And I brought in my 
my little cork holder right here. So he's building up on me again. I had to get another one. I would love to do something creative with them, but for now, that's where they sit. So anyway, I've got my Nancy's Diary wine glasses when I did get on Amazon. I used one of my thumbnail pictures on it, and it's just so much fun. And again, I'm just having a little frozen pizza. And every now and then, Target has sales like 10 for, 10 for, I don't know, 10 for $10 or something. So I stocked up on some of these Jack's miscellaneous pizzas. But this one looks like it's going to be a pretty decent size one. Of course, it's a thin crust. That way I fit more in my freezer. And they're just good for quick snacks. Not just for company or anything, but for me on a weeknight, perfect. And there's pepperoni, there's sausage. There's onions and peppers on this one. So I've got it on. And I love these plates that I got on Amazon, these wine plates. Yeah, I've got like two sets of false graph. I've got my mom's desert rose plates. And then I've got my moon mist china. I've got my melamine plastic dishes, the green and mauves. When green and mauves were in, they used to go in my camper with the colors. And of course, I've got my Harley Davidson plates. I've got way too many plates. I need to get rid of some of them. Anyway gonna have and I don't always know it doesn't always tell you what it is but I'm gonna see if I can swirl this around a little bit and get those fragrances to release and figure out what's in here from the fragrances so anyway gonna have a nice little sniff I hope you guys are having a fabulous week and the rest of your week goes by issue free issue free that's always good I think I'm starting to lose my voice I was on the phone all day today so smells like something citrusy maybe could be orange maybe even like tangerine it's like a heavy sweetness I'm thinking maybe honeydew melon too maybe even a little bit of lemon alrighty cheers everyone happy hump day mmm it's nice and sweet. There's no bitterness. I think there is a little bit of lemon. There's something that's got a little bit of zest in here. Definitely, it tastes like honeydew melon. It's really sweet but mild. And then the orange flavor is is sharp. So I'm thinking maybe tangerine instead of orange because I think that's got a little bit more flavor to it. It's got not really perfect for pizza, but you know what? It's Wednesday. Anything goes Wednesday, right? So anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for taking a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. You guys are awesome, and you all mean so much to me. I hope everyone goes out, has a fabulous, fabulous week. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. Make the most out of your Wednesday, even if you know you've got a lot of work to do in the next two days. You know, Wednesday night, it's all about relaxing. It's all about you, my friends. So take care, everyone. I love you guys so much, and I can't wait to see you in our next video. <sighs> yeah. Take care, everyone. We'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.